Welcome to Peep This Out Reviews with Ian K. Stay frosty. Hey everyone, welcome back to another high quality foodie feature for you here on the channel. This time over at Taco Bell, because not only is the Blue Raspberry Freeze back on the menu for a limited time only, they've got an all new Midnight variant which looks just as refreshing. Guys, feast your eyes on the Midnight Berry Freeze, and I gotta admit, I am already digging this just because of the blue color alone. This is looking pretty fantastic. What we've got here is that standard blue raspberry freeze mixed up with a little blackberry swirl. And as you can see, it's kind of settling on the bottom, but as you can see, nice and dark on this one, guys. Looking pretty nice. I think the combination is gonna be a lovely one. Very nice for a dollar as well. Happy hour special. You can fade that. Let's give it a shot real quick. It's the all new Midnight Berry Freeze, brand new here at Taco Bell. Mmm, instantly sweet. And honestly, I got a lot of the blackberry from the bottom. It's almost like a hyper grape flavor. I'm really digging that actually. And then little accents of the blue raspberry as well. Let's keep going. Mmm. That is refreshing. That combo works actually. But ultra sweet guys, ultra sweet. As you guys can see, very popular with the freezes here at Taco Bell. Nice icy goodness. I'm absolutely staying frosty with this one, but man, this is grit your teeth sweet big time, but I'm really digging the blackberry swirl on the bottom. This is really cool actually. Mmm, frosty cool to be honest. That is nice. Very rich, and again, I'm getting not only just the heightened sugar, but a little bit more of like a hyper grape flavor. Now I know it's blackberry, it's artificial, the blueberry is definitely artificial. This whole thing is artificial, but even still, the color is there. I'm a huge fan of blue. This is definitely up my alley already in the appearance department. But again, the combination of the two is a lovely one. But I got to be honest, by calling this midnight, I was kind of hoping there would be like maybe some candy crescent moons or something in there. Something to kind of really kick it up a little bit. Instead of just combining it and calling it midnight, it really kind of settles on the bottom. So you're really getting literally just the raspberry goodness here, the blue raspberry on the top and then all the other blackberry swirl is gonna to fall to the bottom. So I think having a little bit of crescent moon candy action, kind of like the watermelon freeze from back in the day with those little pits, um, I think that would have been the way to go, but this is still very refreshing. Mmm, yeah, hyper sweet. I'm almost gritting my teeth, literally. I mean, I am gritting my teeth with this, but it's a nice little treat. Again, for a dollar, we'll keep showing you this here. A lovely situation, nice and frosty, always with these freezes here at Taco Bell. I always have a blast checking these out. This is no exception. This is pretty good. Mmm. Really tasty. But, if you want to know my all-time favorite, and most of you regular reviewers of my channel probably know, that pineapple whip freeze is the bomb. That is the one to get, for sure. I really hope they bring that one back. And actually, a little bit of that vanilla syrup would have been a nice little combo to kind of go into this to make it a little bit creamier at the same time. But again, almost like a missed opportunity because I think little candy crescent moons would have been just a cool little accent calling this a midnight berry freeze. Something a little aside from the darkness of it is cool, but I think having that extra in there would have been really, really fun. But still tasty, guys, still tasty. Yeah, I do like it. The flavors are definitely awesome on this. I mean, the artificial raspberry and the heightened version of the blackberry, which is really kind of like a super grape, to be honest. Nice combination with this, guys. Nice combination indeed. So overall, I think on that scale of 1 to 10, I'm going to have to give the all-new Midnight Berry Freeze here at Taco Bell a pretty solid 8 out of 10. This is not going to win any major awards in terms of it being one of the all-time best freezes out there right now. But considering how popular Blue Raspberry is, this is actually, I think, going to be pretty nice satisfaction for most of you who are looking for something like that. Again, it is artificial at the same time, but the heightened version of it, it really is pretty up there. Almost kind of feels like a super jolly rancher in terms of the sweetness and the overall flavor. It's really strong. And again, with that blackberry goodness on the bottom, I'm definitely digging that. But again, I really wish this had something extra to give it that midnight name push. And again, it's just a suggestion, but I think candy crescent moons or something to kind of simulate stars or something like that in this would have been so much fun. A little bit of a missed opportunity, but even still, guys, not bad at all. And again, for happy hour for a dollar, you really can fade that. You really can. All right, so I've got just one simple question for you. Out of all the freezes here at Taco Bell, whether the standard versions or the promo ones they've had over the years, what's your personal favorite? Drop some comments down below and definitely let me know. And with that, this is Ian K closing out another high quality foodie feature for you here on Peep This Out Reviews, bringing you brand new content every single week here on my channel. So why stay tuned for the next review coming real soon. In the meantime, stay frosty. Well, I'd buy that for a dollar and I did, and it was pretty good. All right, guys, until next time, I'll talk to you soon. Hey, thanks for checking out another one of my reviews. But just in case you didn't see the one before this one, you can find it right up over here, along with what I think YouTube's gonna recommend for you to check out as well. As always, I think you'll find something to like in both of them, and I'll definitely catch you in the next one. See ya.